Hello again, everyone. This is Senior Pastor George W. Reese Jr. And I welcome you to the desk from the desk of the pastor. And on behalf of Pastor Mary Reese and all of this Rock Christian Tabernacle, we just thank God for you listening to the words of encouragement on today. And on today, I want to encourage those of you that are worried and concerned about the future, about your past, about uh, maybe what people are saying about you right now. <clears throat> and, and, you know, sometimes uh, things just don't go along just like we would like it. And uh, but I want you to know that God has a word for you on today. And it says in Isaiah 54 and 17, he said, no weapon that is formed against thee shall prosper. And every tongue that shall rise up against thee in judgment, thou shalt condemn. He said, this is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and the righteousness is of me, saith the Lord. And so when you're in Christ and God is on your side, no matter what is going on, uh, no weapon that is formed against you. And we come to understand in life, a lot of time people that we think are on our side, they, <laughs> they're our main enemies. And he said, every tongue that rises up against thee, everybody that is talking bad about you, downing you, they, they, you know, talking about you behind your back and trying to undermine what you're doing or trying to make, belittle you for trying to better yourself and to achieve your goals in life and e even living for God. A lot of times people put you down living for God. God has standards. He has rules. He has commandments for us to live by. And a lot of time, you know, our enemies in our own house because people don't want to live for God. But when you live for God, then the kingdom is yours. I'm talking about a heavenly kingdom with oh, more power than here on earth. I'm talking about a heavenly kingdom from which we were all made from. And so when we start thinking about this, God knows everyone's heart. He knows what they're saying, what they're doing. So he knows when people are, 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 are you know, coming against you, even before you do. He knows what's on people's heart. They may be smiling in your face. They may be tricking you. But God knows what's really going on. And when you are doing uh, the work of the Lord and in his will, no matter what they say or no matter what they do, they cannot stop the plans that God has for you. And sometimes we are our worst enemy, but God still has plans for you. And he won't even let you fail. He won't let you down. Even though you may not have done everything right, in the past or even now. But God is a God that does not forget. And when you turn it yourself over to him, when you repent and ask for forgiveness, God will do exactly what he says he will do. And that no weapon formed against thee shall prosper. And people, uh, my people, my people, uh, we must come to, uh, you know, understanding that, and, you know, we got to be, a, a, you know, as smart as a fox. There are people out there that are, you know, coming against you, using you, trying to do everything they can to put you down without you knowing it. A lot of people want you to fail, but God wants you to be successful in him. And even though things haven't come around the way that you would like right now, just keep on trusting in the Lord. One of my segments or two, I talked about trusting in God. When you trust in God, even though things does not happen exactly when we want to, look like failures have been around every corner. But God wants you to know, keep on trusting in him, knowing that no weapon formed against you shall prosper. And even though people are talking and saying different things, not in your good, but trying to demeanor you and trying to bring you down, God will lift you up. He will keep you your foot planted on solid ground and the plans that he has for you shall come to pass.
Just keep trusting God, knowing that no weapon formed against thee shall prosper, and no every tongue that come up, amen, shall be judged of God when they're talking about you. So God bless you. Have some peace on today. Have peace of mind. God bless you until the next time. See you.